Hi there, Gary here from Longsons. I'm gonna take you on a brief video tour of this uh, really well presented, spacious, detached, four bedroom house, very conveniently situated, right in the heart of Watton Town Centre in Norfolk and all its amenities. Okay, so uh, we're looking at the property there, right in front of us. Uh, it comes with uh, double garage. Uh, there's electric light and power to the double garage as well. We've got plenty of parking to the front, uh, all laid to low maintenance shingle. So I'll just show you the property location. So we're on Harvey Street, um, and just the other side of these properties, uh, on the other side of the road, is uh, the main street in Watton. So there's uh, there's passageways on Harvey Street, so you're literally within short walking distance of the town centre and uh, all its uh, conveniences. So uh, without further ado, let's go and have a look indoors. Well, before we do, I'll just show you, we've also got this area to the side, so there's a small patio seating area with access into the garage. There's also gated access either side of the property to the rear garden. I'll show you the rear garden shortly towards the end of the video. There's also an outside light there and outside tap. Very handy for washing your car, etc. So, well, let's head in through the front door, straight into the entrance hall. So we've got uh, doors off to the various rooms, stairs up to the first floor. There's uh, understairs storage there as well. And what we'll do, we'll start, we'll work our way through. So before I forget, we've got cloakroom on the ground floor with WC and wash basin set within modern fitted cabinets. Property is UPVC double glaze throughout and gas central heating with a combi gas uh, boiler providing hot water and heating. So I'm sure as you've guessed we're now heading into the lounge. We've actually got two reception rooms. So we're starting with the lounge, really good sized room. There's glazed double doors opening through to the dining room. There's uh, a working open fireplace tucked away in the corner there and windows to the front. So we'll head through the uh, double doors into the dining room. French doors opening out to the conservatory. There's a serving hatch through to the kitchen. Good size room. So we'll head through to the conservatory. So that's a UPVC double glazed conservatory with a ceiling fan and lights. So that's two reception rooms and conservatory. So we're now heading back through the dining room and lounge into the entrance hall, back through to the kitchen. So that's a good sized kitchen. We have fitted kitchen units, wall and floor. There's a serving hatch there through to the dining room. There's integrated electric ceramic hob, extractor hood over, it's stainless steel one and a half bowl sink units, mixer tap and drainer. There's integrated double electric oven, space and plumbing for dishwasher and an opening through to the good size utility room where we've got further fitted kitchen units. There's a, an additional stainless steel sink unit, space and plumbing for washing machine. There's space there for tumble dryer, wall mounted combi gas boiler. And there's a entrance door takes you out to the front stroke side of the property with access to the garage and the rear garden. And window looking out to the rear. So uh, a 
a well laid out ground floor. Well, let's head upstairs and have a look at the first floor. So just coming up onto the first floor landing, got a um, built-in storage cupboard, doors off to the various rooms. So we're going to start with bedroom one, a good sized double bedroom. There's uh, fitted wardrobes all the way across the far wall. Window looking out to the uh, rear. And the door through to the ensuite shower room. So we've got modern uh, suite in here. A shower cubicle with a rainfall shower head and a separate hand shower attachment. There's a wash basin. WC and towel radiator. We've then got bedroom two, so another double bedroom, again with fitted wardrobes, window to the front this time. And then we have Third bedroom, currently set up as uh, an office, stroke study, window to the front. And then moving along, last but not least, we have fourth bedroom, also set up as a study stroke office. And again, window to the front. So on the first floor we have the main bathroom, so this is a good size modern bathroom, a luxury bathroom suite, so we've got a standalone double ended bath, we've got a um, standalone uh, tap unit with separate hand shower, hand shower attachments. We've got modern WC and his and her sink units set within modern fitted cabinets and fully tiled walls and towel radiator, obscure glass, double glazed window to the rear. Okay, so that's the property internals. Let's head back downstairs head outside and have a look at the uh, rear garden. So we're heading through the lounge, dining room, conservatory, shoes swiftly back on and out into the enclosed rear garden. So not a bad sized garden at all, laid to lawn. There's gated access both sides of the property, back out to the front. We've got a selection of established shrubs and trees to the borders. There's a wooden garden shed. And the access, as I mentioned, just back down that side, back out to the front. Okay, so that was the brief video tour of this spacious, well-presented, detached four-bedroom house with double garage, very conveniently situated uh, right in the heart of the town centre, uh, very close to all amenities in the Norfolk market town of Watton. Thank you for watching.